Hey, welcome everyone to the new video series Drone Programming with the ROS. In this video series, we will simulate a drone using Gazebo, Software in the Loop and ROS. The video series will start by demonstrating the installation process of tools and software to ensure that you have everything in place. Then we will dive deep into the world of simulation. So before starting, make sure you subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon as I bring such an interesting video every week. So let's get started. Now let's start by going to the repository I have made which demonstrate the whole installation process of Gazebo, SITL and Mavros. So here I have already opened the repository and I'll give this repository link in the description. So I'll open a terminal and I'll start copying this command one by one and pasting it into the terminal. After installing the Mavros, you have to install SITL. First of all, you have to set up the build environment for the Linux. For that, you have to install the git on the computer. As I already have git on the computer, I don't need to run this command. After that, you have to configure the git to use HTTP instead of git. Then clone the RTWRT repository from this link. So it is a very big repository, it may take time. After cloning the repository, you have to go into the repository. After that, we have to install the required packages. Then we have to update the profile. After updating the profile, we have to copy this command and paste it. This will install all the required Linux system packages and Python modules. Now after that, we have to set up the simulation software in Linux. For that we have to move into the Arduipilot directory of which I am already there. I have to set up the profile and then I have to go into Arducopter. After going I can start the simulation of the vehicle. So here you can see the vehicle simulation has been started but at first start it will take a lot of time because of the compiling. Here you can see the Arducopter has started. Now you have to press Ctrl C and stop the process and then start the vehicle normally using this command. Here you can see the three windows coming up. So SITL has been successfully installed into your computer. Now I'll press Ctrl C and go into Gazebo installation. As I have Gazebo already into my computer, so I don't need to install it. So I'll directly go into installation of Gazebo plugin for APM. So I'll copy these commands. First of all, I'll go out of the directory and I'll copy these commands and paste it. As all, I have already cloned this repository, so I don't need to clone it. I'll go into this repository and I'll build it. Okay, then I have to source this repository. 
After that, we are done. Now we can close this terminal and open a fresh terminal. Then we have to split this terminal into three parts. In one terminal, you have to run the gazebo. In the second terminal, we have to run the SITL. And in third terminal, we have to run the Mavros. So you here you can see our drone is in the gazebo environment. So this was all about this video. If you like this video, do like, share and subscribe the channel. Until then, stay creative with me, Technofetch.